News Live 10 at 10 continues with no wait weather. So we've had a nice pattern change out there. We're getting some rain, no severe weather, and no extreme heat. Right. Thinking back to that day of that event, it was hot that mm -hmm. day, very yep. hot, and now we're in the 70s. Yep, and we got more of the same as we go through mm -hmm. the weekend. Let's take a look at that Valley News Live Storm Team Skycam Network shot in Fargo. Plenty of sunshine this morning with increasing clouds as we made our way through later on in the morning and into the afternoon as we faced off to the west. Now, uh, we saw mainly dry conditions here into the southern valley. The rain has stayed mainly into portions of northwestern Minnesota. High temperatures 80 degrees in Fargo, 78 your high Thief River Falls, also at 80 in Jamestown, 75 Devils Lake Valley City, and lower to mid 70s as you make your way across Lakes Country. Current temperatures, we are cooling down nicely, 63 in Fargo, 61 at Wapaton, Gwinner, uh, 64 at Crookston, 60 at Bemidji, and a current temperature mainly into the lower 60s, Devils Lake, Jamestown, and Valley City. Now, the wind speeds, we've gone calm across uh, most of the valley right now. Otherwise, we're seeing uh, more of a northerly or westerly wind between, say, 0 and 10 miles per hour. Now, the satellite loop showing that we are mainly clear and dry across most of the uh, valley location. Just a few passing clouds into the Devil's Lake Basin just north of Jamestown and some showers or sprinkles. One that just moved through the Red Lake area approaching Park Rapids. And uh, any more sprinkles now leaving our viewing area via Hubbard and Wadena County. Now, most of us will stay dry as we go through the overnight period. High pressure off to our south is in charge. Have this nice warm front that's going to make its way through, and this low will move northwest to southeast across our viewing area and bring some more much-needed rain into portions of western North Dakota. Now, let's take a look at the uh, maps. We've got partly cloudy skies, temperatures falling into the low to mid-50s for tonight, and uh, our model still painting that rain, sometimes heavy at times where they need it the most, south of I-94 in portions of western North Dakota. That moisture will get into our viewing area mainly into the afternoon with some scattered showers and possibly some thunderstorms that will dissipate as we get rid of the daytime heating. Planning your day tomorrow in Fargo, a cool start into the mid-50s at 7 o'clock, getting to around 74 by noon, mostly cloudy skies. Temperatures a little below normal for this time of year, high of 76 degrees with that chance of showers as we make our way through the early evening in Fargo, elsewhere across the Southern Valley. Temperatures mainly ranging from the mid 60s to mid 70s. We've got a chance of some showers, a slight chance of some showers under mostly cloudy skies into Lakes Country, low to mid 70s. We're going to see low to mid 70s into portions of northwestern Minnesota. Uh, we're going to keep that slight chance of some showers and make your way into the northern valley with temperature staying into the low to mid 70s. And then for the day on Sunday, our model showing that we are mainly dry. We do have a chance of some showers, especially into the southern valley, but they uh, look more isolated on the uh, new run with uh, partly cloudy skies, mainly the story. We're going to stay cool into the low to mid 70s as we go through the day on Sunday. Here is the photo of the day. Nancy Rice calls it weird cloud. This is actually the uh, some of the clouds that were responsible for some of those funnels yesterday. This is out of the Park Rapids area. We'll use that in the background of the seven day forecast. Recapping the next couple of days, a chance of some showers on Saturday and Sunday as temperatures stay into the mid to upper 70s. Monday looks sunny, a high of 82 degrees. 81 on Tuesday, a chance of some showers and storms in the afternoon and evening with some remnant moisture on Wednesday, then partly cloudy as temperatures stay into the mid to upper 70s on Thursday and Friday. All right, thanks, Justin. Mm -hmm.